yo what's good everybody it's me connor back here with another video and in today's episode we're taking a few steps back but a whole lot of steps forward as most of you know i've had this ford raptor grill on the truck for the longest time but in today's video we're gonna be going back to the stock grill until i can get a platinum grill but that's not the point of this video the point of this video is that we're going to be painting this grill so what i'm thinking is all out here black and all the insert grills blue and then i'm going to get a badge that goes here that glows white in the middle that's black and i feel like that would look very very sick and a lot of you might be asking why am i doing the outside of the grill black and not white because i am eventually going to be wrapping the truck matte black <laughs> two pieces separated now I just got to take this emblem off and then we can start prep I just sprayed them both with the hose now I'm gonna hit them with some La totally awesome and some degreaser this stuff takes everything off so whatever's left on there will not be on there for long And I just got to spray that one. This thing has never looked so clean and shiny. And this stuff in this bottle, yes, this is a different bottle. But the stuff I put in this bottle is a dollar from the dollar store. Okay. Then we're going to hit it one more time just to get all that stuff off. Make sure you get both sides. Take it, put it in the sun so it can dry for a little bit. Now, just gotta spray this one down. I already sprayed it with water, but as you can see, it's still dirty. So I'm just gonna clean it one more time. I did do a light sand on this one. I don't really have to do it on that one. But then we're gonna start with primer, then make sure it sticks to plastic. And we're gonna do both just one coat i normally don't do primer on stuff but this is like a metallic silver so i got to see if I can fix that before I do the first coat of blue so this one has one coat of primer that has one coat of blue paint so now I need to do three coats of black on this and two more coats of blue on that but first I got to let them dry and fix that crack like I just showed you guys this is the stuff I bought to fix the crack and I will say it did a damn good job now I just got to sand it and maybe put one more coat of this on just to make sure it's flat but i gotta let it dry first i did the second coat this wasn't in the video this is just something else the lower grill i grabbed but i did the second coat 
of the blue on the panels and it is looking very nice. I would say blue and white does go together really well, but I like the black truck first or better because white is so hard to match. Like this isn't the same color white as on my truck. Can hardly even tell there was a crack there. So I already did three coats of blue on both, one coat of blue on that, and now I just did my first coat of black on this, and I think it came out amazingly. If you come here and look, you can't even tell that there was crack there. And now I just got to do two more coats of black here, three coats of clear on both of those, and then three coats of clear on this. But I'm going to do that tomorrow. So I already did one coat of clear on that one coat of clear on this and I did the other two coats of black and I think it came out amazingly you can't even see that there was a crack there and then I started painting that blue for now I was gonna tape it off and paint the inside black but I couldn't figure out how well not that I couldn't figure out but it was way too difficult to cut out after masking so it's whatever I'll paint it all blue till I get the new emblem now I gotta do two more coats of clear on that, one coat of clear on this, or three coats of clear on this, my bad. So this is what it looks like together. I really like it. I think it looks sick. So now we just gotta put the emblem on and we go put it back on the truck. And this is what the truck looks like. I think it looks pretty sick if I do say so myself. All it's missing is the black Ford symbol in the middle. I'm gonna try to go print out a sticker for it now, just to make it stand out. This is with the bottom grill in. So I personally think it came out amazingly. So I did come to find out that the clips up here are broken. So I am gonna be buying a new grill. Yes, I know I just did all this paint on this one, but I am gonna be buying a new grill. and I'm gonna have it professionally painted because it kind of already chipped at the top a little bit, but I fixed that. But I'm just gonna buy a new grill because I like it, but, or not even buy one. I'm probably just gonna go to a scrap yard and get, a, get one off of a truck, take it somewhere, get it color matched to the black mat that I'm gonna be wrapping the truck just to make it match. But for now, until I do that, I like the look of it a lot better. I even put in the bottom blue right there, and I, I will say, it looks a lot better than the fake Raptor grill.